Hello, everybody! Welcome back to the episode of Ark Survival Evolved on the Gaming Evolved Scorched Earth server. Alright, guys. So, I got big plans today. Oh, I'm showing you secrets. You're not supposed to see those. Shh, shh, shh. <laughs> Alright, guys. So, I got big plans today. Sort of. Uh, so, we got some building done around the house first off. I want to show you some stuff real quick uh, before we go on about our day. I did some stuff off camera because I figured the building, you know, it, we've, we've done building before. If you guys would rather see the building parts of it, then let me know and then I can do some of the building on camera, but I don't really know how much more building we're going to do around here because I don't want to make anything too crazy big because, you know, we're just a community and I don't want to do anything crazy. But anyway, so what I've done here, you might notice there's some things around here. Uh, I added a little fence area out here just because I thought it looked nice <laughs> and I also ran water so we got water that goes over there all the way over here I put these over here just because I thought it looked nice <laughs> I really just put stuff down because I think it looks nice I added a ramp over here I had to extend out the deck used to end right here and I used to have a ramp over here uh, but then I extended the deck out just to make it look a little bit nicer it was mainly because I wanted to hide the uh, the pipe that goes down through here um, but yeah I really tried my best to hide all these pipes. I'll show you where that pipe leads to here in just a moment. You might have saw a peek of it. So um, I couldn't fit a foundation over here. So what I did is I put a ceiling down and then I put uh, fence foundations down over here and then placed walls on them to kind of make it look a little bit nicer, a little bit more natural. Okay, so we got water that goes into there. Now where does it go? What does it do? Why are we having it? So if we come in through the door here, uh, you'll notice some more changes in here. So we have the water pipes that go through here, perfectly fits through this window, <laughs> and it's irrigating these crop plots over here. Perfect. Uh, I just plan on putting, you know, the uh, the normal... What's attacking? <laughs> I just plan on putting um, the advanced crops in here, you know, the citronol, rock carrots, and all that kind of stuff. I'll plan on putting that stuff over there. Uh, let's see here. I went out and tamed us up a dung beetle. It was really low level, level 8 when I first found them. Um, and I got him in here. I put him in this little spot over here because I didn't want him outside wandering around in case he just kind of decides to, I don't know, wander away too far. I was thinking about putting him out here, but I didn't really want him to wander out. So, pardon me there. I put a, I put a little spot in here for him. Uh, let's, I'm going to pick him up because he's not really wandering around. He wanders, don't worry. Uh, anything else I did inside of here? No, nothing else I did inside of here. I went ahead and made another trophy base for the uh, artifact of the crag up here. Pretty cool spot, I believe so myself. Alrighty. And then next... Hey, keep it out of here. You see this? There's a ladder inside this wall. It's really weird how that place. I couldn't figure out how to get this place right. I put a crop plot up here. What's your problem? Morala tops. I don't know what's going on here. I don't know why we have morale. Oh, because they're attacking the fence over there. Don't attack our wall. And so I put a uh, I put a water tap up here and I put a crop plot up here because I want to see what those plant species Y seeds do. So that's that's why I put that in there. So I, do I have any in my inventory? No, I don't. Alrighty. Uh, so let me go grab one of those. I want to just go ahead and plant it and get it growing while we're out doing other things. So maybe it could happen. Maybe we could see what happens with it. Um, let's see here. I think I got some of it over here. I do. All right, we got five fertilizers. There we go. I thought I wasn't moving for a second. All righty. Why is this door open? All right, perfect. All right, so yeah, I figured we could uh, get the plant species YC going because I want to see what it does. Um, I'm kind of curious of what we can do with it. So let's go ahead and drop this in here and all of you. All right, amazing. Wow, you look weird. Let's put this away and put this away. <laughs> It's just like one little spot. <laughs> you see that? It's like one little thing up there. All right, amazing. All right, guys. So thank you guys for all the support in the previous videos. I really appreciate it. You guys are so amazing, so kind. I love your comments and all the likes. Keep up the awesome work. I got you guys. I love it. Um, so guys, thank you guys so much. Uh, also, some other things we're going to talk about here in just a moment. Um, but yeah, so the uh, wanted to talk to you guys about uh, some of you guys might wipe watch wipe watch my Tempest series, um, and I will be continuing that, don't worry, um, I just didn't want to, 
Well, I wanted to get a lot of these uh, Arc Scorched Earth videos out because it's a big update and everybody really wanted to see it. So I just kind of wanted to do that instead of doing uh, some of the Tempest. But uh, I'll be bringing the series back, so don't worry about that. We will be doing that. So, okay. anyways, all right, guys. Um, so what we're going to do now is I'm going to go out and I'm going to look for a Praying Mantis. Oh, but first we need Bug Spray. Crap, we need Bug Spray. <laughs> Um, we need bug spray because, uh, from what I've heard from the other server members is that the, the praying mantis are actually a passive team, so we need pelt, narcotics, citronol, and rock carrot. Luckily, the you know, Nago planted some of those seeds right away, <laughs> like, episode one, she planted these things. Um, so we have some of those crops ready, and I haven't really got mine going yet. So, what is it, citronol, rock carrot, pelt, and narcotics. I think I have some narcotics over at our place. I just have to get some pelts, which is not hard to get. There's plenty of stuff to get pelts from around here. But let's see here. Any rock hair and citronol. Where do we keep that stuff? Oh, are these... Uh-oh, we need spark powder for these guys. Uh, yep, we need spark powder for these guys too. Uh-oh. Uh, who has spark powder? Spark powder, spark powder. Uh, let's see here. <laughs> Alright, spark powder. Amazing. Alright, let's go put that in there real quick. I didn't see any of the crops in there, though. Um, we haven't really done anything with the refrigerators yet because uh, we're kind of worried about the storms. You know, that would be terrible. Uh, why, what is, why is this a thing right now? Alright, here we go. Alrighty. Uh, th so, th we were going to use the the refrigerators but the uh, the storms can turn off your generators and you know it just kind of makes it for a bad deal although running out of spark powder is a bad deal too so i guess we'll have to keep a better eye on that <laughs> all right so let's go ahead and drop this stuff back in here we'll drop those and let's go see if we can find some citronella rock carrot are these things still good over here do we have fertilizer in them what's going on yes all right uh i forgot how many it was i'm just gonna take 10 of those and ten of those. Amazing. Thank you, Mago. Don't worry, I got more stuff growing. Why did I why did I bring a dragon over here? That was the worst idea ever. Dragons are just hard to land and hard to maneuver around the base. Should have just brought the RG. Alright. But yeah, it's, placing those pipes was like the worst thing ever in the world. I had to do it twice. <laughs> the first time I lined it up, it didn't really, f it didn't irrigate the one on top, so I had to do it all over again. It was kind of funny. Alrighty, so we got those. We need pelts. I should have got the pelt before I got the citronol. Right? Right. I definitely should have. Alright, let's go do that. Let's go get some pelt real quick. Uh, close. Close. Thank you. Alrighty, perfect. Ugh. So I took Balboa out the other day, uh, Jack and I, and we went to try to go try to go kill some of the uh, the death worms, and it was it was easy. Um, it took a lot of hitting for them to uh, to die because I don't know it, they don't do that much damage. The uh, the rock elementals don't do that much damage, so it was a lot of work to try to kill one, and it took it down to like half health, and that was the only one that we killed. So then I came up with another idea, and it actually worked out really well. I'll show you what that idea is. Let me find some citronol, or not some citronol, some, something to give us pelt real quick, and then I'll show you guys what that idea was. But uh, yeah, we went out and uh, hunted some death worms, because apparently what you need for these, you are an uh, elemental. Um, apparently what you need for taming up a mantis is uh, death worm spikes. That's kind of like their kibble deal. How have I, how have I not seen anything for pelt? Wolf? Wolf. Anybody see a wolf around here? There's a saber tooth. Do Procoptonauts give pelts? I want to say yes. Let's go find out. Come here. Oh, I. Yeah, here we go. Rawr. Do you get pelt? You do get pelt. Amazing. Alright. Well, that was easy. Uh, but yeah, so we went out and hunted some uh, death worms so we can get some of the death worm spikes. They are actually not that hard to kill once we figured out the uh, the method of doing it. And they're pretty easy to find once we figured out the easiest method of doing that. Alrighty, so we're going to go back here. I'm going to make some bug spray, and then I'll go out and hunt for a mantis that I want to tame up. And then as soon as we find one, I guess I'll be right back for that. So give me just one second, guys. I, I know it's a lot of talking. So let me go ahead and do that real quick, and then I'll be right back. See you guys in a bit. Alright guys, we're back. And crap, there's bugs. 
<laughs> Get out of here. Alright. So, check it out, guys. I can't believe this has just happened. I wish I had three more death worm spikes. Check this out. Male, 120. Female, 120. What the crap? <laughs> I would have never thought that was going to happen. Alright, but anyways, let's go ahead and use this bug spray. Uh, we probably have to put this in our last inventory slot. Alright, let's see if we can come over here and... You know, make this make this guy our friend. Let's check this out. Let's check this out. I don't know how to do this. I'm terrified. Really terrified. Which one do I want? I want the female. Alright, let's see if we could do this. I'm still terrified. Still terrified. Okay, let me let me just walk up to you. Are you the female? Are you the female? Yes. No, 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 hold on, okay, shh, <laughs> I don't know how this works, but we're gonna try it, I wish they would stop moving, so I could try this, oh man, just stop right there, there you go, do you want some food, I'm trying to give you a spike, dang it, take a spike, how do you do this, <laughs> can I give you, ah, I got it, okay, all right, perfect, Ooh, okay, okay, all right, amazing, Alright, sweet. So that's how you tame a mantis. Alright, so we got one spike. We need to do two more of them. Alright, perfect. That's amazing. Alright, guys. I'm going to work on this a little bit more. And then once we get this tamed up, I'll be right back. I'll see you guys in a bit. I'm super excited. Alright, guys. We're back. And we did it. Amazing. We have a mantis now. We have a perfect tame mantis. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> that was scary. That was really terrifying. These things are really terrifying to do this. Uh, let's see here. We're going to make you... Let's see. Are you praying mantis? Um, I don't know yet. We'll figure that out here in just a moment. Oh my gosh. Check this out. Perfect tame mantis. Alright. So we got 24, 20 health, 525 stamina, uh, 316 weight, 214 melee damage, and 167% movement speed. Oh crap. We gotta go. Here. Just actually... Can you... Can you kill that thing? Yeah, you kill it. Get it. Get it, Mantis. You got it. You got this. Yeah, you got that, Mantis. Amazing. Take it. Take it. Kill it. Kill it. Amazing. All right, amazing. All right, I was trying to find out if anybody has any extra horns around here, but um, I guess I don't think so. All right, so let me go ahead. We'll pick her up with uh, the dragon over here, and I haven't named him yet. Some of you guys were asking about a name on him. I haven't named her yet, him, uh, but if you guys could think of a name, that would be great, so uh, please leave it in the comments below. Um, so anytime you guys think of a name for a dino, just let me know in the comments below. I'm more than happy to name something after you guys. All right, so unfortunately, I don't think we have any more death worm spikes. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and come back to base and see if we can make up a saddle. I did find in a red drop the other day a Mastercraft Mantis saddle blueprint. So I think we're going to go see if we can make that up and put on this guy and test him out. So, all right, I'm going to do that, gather up the supplies, get the saddle going. As soon as I do that, I'll be right back. So I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, guys, we're back. And this saddle is pretty expensive, actually. So we're crafting it up right now. It costs 1868 hide, 1168 fiber, and 545 metal. Pretty expensive, but still worth it. All right, sweet. Let's check this out. Let's put the saddle on you. There we go. So it's got a hands option here. All right, let's check this out. Monomantis! Oh, my God. Wah! That was the right-click attack, so that's amazing. Oh, my gosh. Arr, I'm on a mantis. This is amazing. Oh, did you just gather fiber? You're amazing. You can gather fiber. Check this out. Oh my god, this is so cool. I'm on a giant mantis. I like how it stands on that. Look at that. He's holding on to his horns. Or the saddle reins. I don't know. It's hard to tell. But he's just standing on the back of it. It's pretty awesome. That's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Alright, so we got... Uh, so that's the left click attack. It switches between those. And then the right click attack is the jump attack. That's amazing. Or the lunge attack. And let's see here. He doesn't jump, amazingly enough, and there's no C attack. Alright, amazing. But the most amazing thing about this, check this out, guys. Let's put this here. That's right. We can hold weapons. It's amazing. 
Some fish oil, the most amazing animal ever. Or mounts ever. Oh god, it's so cool. That's so cool. We gotta go kill some stuff with it. First, let's pump some stats here. I don't know what we're gonna pump on it yet. Um, Let's actually... There's a training dummy over here. Let's go check that out. I don't know if that's a w an effective way of getting around. He is slow, though. <laughs> He's pretty slow. Alright, let's check it out. Let's go. Let's do this. Oh, that's really hard to aim that, that's for sure. 62. Oh, not very amazing. What if I take the weapons out of your hand? Let's try that. Let's take the weapons out of your hand. Oh, 840. What the, what the crap? Why would you want to wait? Oh, oh, that makes no sense at all. We are not putting weapons in your hands. It's amazing, but we are not doing it. <laughs> Alright, let's see if we can figure out this lunge attack thing. Alright, let's go. Oh, we almost had that. That was so close. It's really hard to uh, aim that. Alright, let's try this again. You ready? 462. Amazing. <laughs> It does half the damage of the swipe. <laughs> okay. Alright, sweet. So here we go. We're going to pick this guy up over here just in case there's a storm on its way. Let's go ahead and level you up. Let's give you a couple points into health. Oh, wow. You do not level up very much at all. Alright, well, this should be interesting. Let's go see if we could do some leveling up. You know what we haven't done yet? We haven't done something this season. We have not done a level up montage at all on this, this series. Which is amazingly weird that we haven't done that, since we can fly dragons now. But anyways, alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go out do a little level up montage for us. And uh, we'll see what kind of level we can get him up to. Alright guys, I'm going to do that and I'll be right back. So I'll see you guys in a bit. Enjoy the montage. Alright guys, we're back and I had to cut the montage a little short there. Sorry about that. We had a sandstorm coming. I was trying to get back to base so I could try to not be in it, but it uh, looks like we're in it now. We're pretty close back to base, but yeah, I think that is going to be it for us today though, guys. We did a lot of stuff today. Well, not really a lot of stuff, but uh, I did a lot of stuff off camera that I showed you guys. We got the, oh, you know what we need to do? We need to go check on those plant species wise. Let's do that first, actually. Let's not even cut right here. Alright, let me do this. I'm going to go ahead and go back to the base. This is really going to be bad because, uh, wow. Alright, I'm going to see if I can get back to the base. And then uh, I'm going to go to check on our plant species Y as soon as the sandstorm is over. So give me just a few moments, guys. Sometimes these stand sandstorms last uh, a decent amount of time or they could be pretty quick. It just all depends. But yeah, alright guys. Give me just a bit. I'll see you in a bit. 
All right, guys, we're back. Sandstorm is over. Just ended a minute ago. Let's go ahead and check out up here, see if our plant species Y seed is growing up. I don't know how long it takes for them to grow up and mature, but I know it hasn't really been long enough for us to do it yet. Yeah, it's not it's not growing up yet. Anything about it? It's still a seedling. Uh, we'll have to check that out probably in the next episode, though, guys, because uh, I don't really have time to wait around for that thing to grow up. I don't know how long it's really going to take. But anyways, guys, if you guys like the video, press that like button. It helps me out so much. Also, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you subscribe and don't so you can see the rest of the content, the art content. So, all right, guys, I'll see you next time. Bye!